Hey, what is up everyone? It is Shahzad here again back with another video and today I have my review of the top 5 exposed modules that you can get. So without any wasting of time, let's jump right into it. So if you guys don't really know what is exposed module is, I will leave a direct link to the XDA page in the description section of this video. So I will prefer you all to just go ahead and just uh, see some of the instructions before attempting these stuffs. So let's jump right into it. And if you are interested in downloading any of the modules that I am showing here, what you guys can do here is just go into the exposed installer app. Then go into the download section and just search for all the modules that I am showing you. It will be available here. So with that, uh, so let's get started with the number five. So at number five, we have the YouTube Add Away, as the name really implies to the uh, to the main working of this app. This basically, uh, this app basically hides all the ads and logos and the channel suggestions that you basically see in your YouTube app itself. There is nothing in the settings you can basically uncheck the things that you want to see in your YouTube player or the YouTube app of your Android and this is pretty much the best module that you can get to get rid of all the ads that is shown in the YouTube app itself. So make sure you check it out this check out this module it is called YouTube Ad Away. So at number 4 we have the X Halo floating window. So what this app allows you to do is to have a pop up sized window of any kind of apps that you need. It is just similar, a little bit similar to what we see in the multi window itself. So once you have installed this module you can go into the pop up behavior and whitelist all the app that you want. So uh, for the example I will just going to show you uh, if you want you can enable any kind of app that you want. I'm gonna uh, just to install, uh, just check on any kind of app. So uh, once you have whitelisted that app, what you have to do here is open up that app, and you will see that it will open up in a pop-up window. And there is an option that you can basically change the height and length of this app itself. It is a very cool module, and make sure you guys check it out. It is called X Halo Pro Window. So at number 3 we have the XUI mod. It is basically a collection for all the tweaks and stuffs that you that generally all the rooted Android devices, uh, rooted Android users need. So yeah, once you have opened this module you will going to see all of the uh, things and all of the mods that is available in this one. So just for the... Uh, so we have some of these uh, settings for the clock clock mod, battery mod, battery bar mod, notification mod and we also have uh, uh, with the help of this module you can also change the animation settings just like uh, you can change the window transition effects to some other ROMs effect just like the Xperia Z1 effect you have to reboot for it but this is a pretty cool kind of mod here you can change per app uh, animation just like opening app animations and closing app animations this is a pretty cool mod and uh, we also have some of the other settings that you can tweak on just like the lock screen mods, scrolling mods and other mods is also available in this one. So this is a pretty cool mod. It is called XUI mod. So make sure you go ahead and check it out. So at number 2 we have a app called Unicorn. I have reviewed this app uh, a little while ago on this channel. This is uh, this app is available in the Play Store but requires you to have a exposed installer installed onto your device. So once you have installed the exposed installer, you are ready to go. And what this app basically allows you to do is to replace your icon packs on any of the launcher that you want. So suppose that if you have a Google Experience launcher running just like mine and the Google Experience launcher, launcher doesn't really support any kind of icon packs. So with the help of this app you can basically change any of the icon packs on any of the launcher that you want. Like I did here I have the Halo launcher, uh, Halo icon pack running here on my Google Experience launcher. So this is a pretty cool app which basically allows you to change your icon packs on any of the launcher that you want so make sure you go ahead and check it out and also if you want an, uh, other information about this uh, this application itself I have reviewed this a while ago on my channel so you can check it out as well so that's pretty much it about the number second one so at number one we have the most one of the most popular module for the exposed it is called a gravity box it is basically known for its tons of tons of customizations uh, settings so once you have jumped into this you guys will be able to see tons of menu that uh, 
basically uh, you can tweak uh, everything with the help of the one app itself just like we have for the example we have the lock screen tweaks status bar tweaks navigation bar tweaks by controls transparency manager and lots of lots of other stuffs that is you can tweak on for the example if I just jump into the transparency manager you can basically change the transparency of your status bar and the transparency of your navigation bar so if you are on the Android 4.3 like I am so you can basically transparent your status bar with the help of this app there are tons of tons of other tweaks that you can tweak on for your smartphone and this is one of the all-in-one the best module that you can get for your rooted devices so this is the reason why it is on the number one and that's pretty much it guys thank you very much for watching hope you guys have enjoyed this video and if you did don't forget to give this video a like rating and subscribe to my channel if you don't really want to miss my upcoming videos as well and thanks again for watching and i'll talk to you guys in my next one bye bye now